briefly, we're going to talk about atomic mass unit. Where did that ANU come from? Um, so here's the definition. One ANU is 112 of one carbon-12 atom. What a mouthful. How many times can you say one and 12 in one definition? Um, now, here's the deal, where this came from. We needed a standard. We needed a standard to compare all of the masses of each element. Um, and so we used carbon-12. Now, think about this. Years and years and years ago, there was maybe a king that wanted to measure the length of his kingdom. And so he could choose anything. He would maybe choose the length of his arm from fingertip to elbow, cut a piece of wood, and send out a squire to measure the length of his kingdom. He could pick anything. We could measure with paper clips. Um, I could measure how many pencils this is. So this really, in a way, is an arbitrary choice. We chose carbon-12 as um, the reference for all of our mass measurements. Um, now, why did we choose carbon-12? Some obvious reasons. Super stable, um, inexpensive, and highly abundant. Now, scientists were so smart when they did this. Carbon-12, that 12 is the mass. It means that there are six protons and six neutrons. So, by saying one AMU is 1 12th of one carbon-12 atom, in essence, what they're saying is one proton or one neutron is one AMU. But I can't go to the grocery store and buy a bag of protons or a bag of neutrons. But wow, we have access to carbon. So it was a, a brilliant way to, in essence, say a proton and a neutron is one AMU. Now, some details on this. Technically, one AMU is this super small grams, okay, mass in grams, 10 to the negative 24 on that magnitude. Um, I wanted you to see that neutrons and protons aren't spot on one, but we round them to one when we're just really fast um, doing, um, doing our work. And a lot of times um, on our periodic table, especially if you're doing AP and Gen Chem, you're going to round to the hundredths place. Um, so we could say that uh, the one neutron you can see is AMU, but we'll say it's one. The one proton will say it's one AMU. Check out the electron, 0. 0.0005. AMU, um, that the electron is on the magnitude of 2,000 times smaller than the proton and the neutron. So there you have it, definition for atomic mass units.